the i8s and just like regular like five series and y'all see them right there what's up y'all welcome welcome back to another drive with me or welcome back to another video so today as you see with the title you guys want to ride with me this time so we're gonna be doing um a lot of stuff we're gonna be talking about quarantine and, and everything work life all that good stuff in this one video so make sure you guys stay tuned and just stay happy <laughs> i'm weak but um but yeah just make sure you guys to stay tuned it's gonna be entertaining all right so i'm waiting for my car to warm up i just got in here usually it me like five minutes so it's like Five minutes to me is like five seconds to y'all because I'm going to be right back on the camera. Of course. Y'all see I got the dewy on. Got the dewy on. What is going on with your hair? I don't know what I'm doing with my hair right now. But, um, yeah, what's going on with the hair, though? I can't tell y'all. Confidentiality. But, yeah, let's get back into the video. I'll see you guys once the car warms up. Peace! Waiting for the car to warm up like. <laughs> this is about to be funny. I'm waiting for the car to warm up. What I want to say. Bro, this car don't hurry the fuck up and warm up. Man, that's crazy. Bro, I'm ready to go, bro. I gotta go. I gotta go. Ooh, did I almost drop my phone? All right, so while the car warming up, I'm gonna um, go grab my other phone. Hopefully, we can play some music. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Because uh, I ain't trying to get copyrighted. So, if not... It is what it is, so go ahead, lock the car, let it warm it up, and see you guys in a bit. Alright, so I just made the ghetto -less, um <laughs> tripod about. <laughs> I mean, I got a tripod mount right here, but it, it's not going to look good because it's going to be vertical instead of horizontal. So what I did, I advise y'all to do this. I use my other phone, my other iPhone, the city right there, so it can stay right here. Hopefully it'll stay right here while we're driving. But if not, you know, I gotta keep my eyes on the road. Safety first. Always remember that. Oh, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> nah, but yeah. Um, hopefully this works though. This stays while we drop around for a little bit. Might stop. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna drop around for a little bit and we're gonna talk. Let's get it. So yeah, you know what I'm saying? Everybody in the quarantine and stuff. I'm out here working and everything, you know. If y'all don't know, I work at Amazon. So if y'all really want to see a video, y'all really want to see me do a video, just just hit that like button on this video. Like, come on now. Who not want to see a video of me working at Amazon? Like, you know what I'm saying? Just giving my experience on it. But so far, it's like, I'm like day three, day four. And it's not bad though, it's, it's, it's labor. If you like labor work, then I suggest um, do that, to be honest, because if, if you if you can stand on your feet, if you can stand on your feet for long periods of time, then I suggest to do that. Um, so I ain't really got too much to talk about, but I'm trying to talk about enough. That what you know, what I'm saying what's going on in my life, pretty much. So this is like a little what's going on in my life, a little lit. It's gotta be lit, bro. I'm trying to be entertaining for you guys, man. That's the biggest thing when it comes down to it. I'm trying to be entertaining for you guys, and and I've been doing that so. But yeah, enough of that. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, that's the I-8. I wish I could. I wish I could. Oh, I might just try to follow him. Bro, I've been seeing this I-8 all around, y'all. That's crazy. I've been seeing him all around. And what you call it? He live around my blocks. So it's just like, damn, I just see a BMW i8 in person. You feel me? But that bitch is nice. He got like a black and blue. It's black and blue stripes one. I never seen a black and blue striped one. I always just seen a regular black one or just a regular white, like a white classic I8. Ooh, man. It's crazy part about it. Soon as I get another BMW, I see hella BMWs, just not even I8s, just like regular, like five series and five series, three series and stuff. And, that, and that's crazy though, cause you see a lot of them like all around and stuff when you get one, you feel me? It could be a Honda. You're going to see a bunch of hella Honda Civics Accords and shit. Like, come on now. Like, that's crazy, B. That's crazy, B. 
So I'm behind the I-8. That's crazy. Let me see if I can get a little footage for y'all. Y'all see him right there? Yes, sir, Ski. <laughs> Let me put this back at the popo right there. <laughs> they probably all with the oh. It dropped, so I'll get you guys in a minute. All right, so I'm gonna put you guys on my lap for a second. So we'll go get back into it. All right, so I'm trying to pitch you guys. I think I think my phone didn't like that I ate. I think that's why. I think that's why my phone dropped. <laughs> Cause it was stable until I picked it up, and then we was trying to show you guys the I ate, and it just like dropped. So that's crazy. But yeah, man, the I ate. I mean, I've been seeing a lot of BMWs and all that, but yeah. But tell me how y'all been though. Tell me like how y'all really been during the quarantine. Like did the quarantine made you think? Because quarantine made me think a little. Oh, again, man, I can't do this. I'll pick you guys up. I'm just gonna put you guys on my lap. But yeah, tell me how the quarantine been, y'all. Like, I'm gonna pull over in a minute and fix this again. But tell me how the quarantine been doing for y'all. I mean, it woke me up, to be honest. I've been looking stuff completely different nowadays. And it's just like, damn, bro. It is what it is. And I'm woke. And it's like, I don't even have to work no more. It made me realize to focus on myself a lot more, if, if that makes sense, so. But yeah, let me pull over here. Pull over here, right face, and fix you guys. I'm gonna fix you guys in a second. Just hold on, hang tight. All right, so we're gonna try this one more time. So I might, I might just stop here and just talk to you guys because I don't want to make this video too long or not too short, you know. All right, so I'm back. So you already know I had to park because it wasn't going to work out because my phone kept falling and everything, blah, blah, blah. You already know the whole nine. So once I get this tripod, you feel me? We're going to be lit like I'm trying to tell you. I'm getting this tripod and we're going to stack all these videos up, baby. What it do, baby? <laughs> all right, I'm too loud for the camera. Let me stop it. Make sure my music is off because I don't like getting copyrighted. So, um... Yeah, man, I'm just saying. And I would give you guys like little tips too. I'm like, like first cars to buy. This is just a random ass video, just a random ass driver. You feel me? I want to be entertaining, entertaining, entertaining. So the first cars to buy, I would recommend for starting off. I know most of you guys like probably getting in the car, getting the first car and everything. And um, so I say the first cars to buy to recommend is Honda, Toyota, Lexus, um. Hyundai in there. Yeah, Hyundai in there. Um, Kia. I got a whole list I could name. I could name them for days. So those are the best cars to buy. But I mainly will say like Honda, Toyota. If you really want to go on like cheap maintenance side. See, easy to maintain. Fun car, reliable car. And that's what I said they did at the beginning. Got one of them. Um, but I instead, my first car, my very first car was a Chevy. And I still have it. So I have... I don't like bragging about my cars. That's that's the only thing, though. I hate that. You see, you know how most people, they ask you... Like, when people ask me about my cars and shit, they be like, how many cars you got? Or they be like, what kind of car you got? I'm like, man, I don't, that's what I tell them. I'm like, I don't like bragging because it's weird. Because it's, it's a meaning behind each car that I buy. You see what I'm saying? It's a meaning that I buy a car. I'm not going out here buy a car just because I'm bored. You feel me? I ain't got that kind of money like that. Like, no, sir. I'm not trying to be IRS tax. I mean, you already got to pay property tax. You got to realize that. You might own the car, but you got to pay property tax on that car every fucking year. Oh, oh my bad. <laughs> I cuss too. That's crazy. But, um, but yeah, you got to, like, be realistically. Get, that's where I messed up at because I'm paying three property taxes on three cars, pretty much. So, it sucks, but... I mean, it is what it is. It's once a year, so it's not that bad. And then you got to get inspected. Got to get tires and stuff. And I wouldn't recommend BMW as a first car. But if you want to get it, go ahead and get it. I mean, all I know, they say that it was unreliable. I mean, that's true. But you want to have something more reliable. This is reliable, the one I got. Even my old one, my other one that I have. And... And it, both of them is reliable so far. It's just that the parts is just more maintained. Don't let nobody like stop you from buying your 
dream car or whatever just because it say ain't reliable it's up to you if you want that car you'll go get it like if i want this bmw i want it but i didn't really want it this bmw what i really wanted was a honda a honda accord that's all i wanted and call it a day because i know they got savers and stuff and my car got saver too but i just like the look of it and everything but um yeah that's enough about cars to be honest really um let's get into some relationship fellas 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 bro hey man there's a bunch of toxic women out here bro i mean don't fall for it bro we got to stack our cheddar bro this is 2020 we in a quarantine for this bro stack our cheddar we not worrying about no female no more females be playing games nowadays y'all so stack our cheddar fellas you already know the bag gonna love us and it's, you know what I'm saying? Girls can flirt all day just because they bored. And I took a meaning of that, you feel me? It's just like, damn, when I flirt back or whatever, it's like, damn, I'm in trouble, you feel me? So I didn't know the consequences. It's part of growing up. And I'm trying to tell you, I'm woke after this quarantine, bro. This quarantine woke me up. So, yeah, man. Quarantine really did a lot. <laughs> it helped me realize who's there for me and who's not. And it's true. And it re well, mainly, I'm not worrying about that part. I'm mainly worried about myself. So, you know what I'm saying? Focus on myself, man. Focus on myself. So, you know, job, working every day, trying to put YouTube videos out for you guys. And I'm trying to do everything for you guys. I'm trying to be a busy man today. You feel me? I'm trying to stay busy and stay ready for you guys. All in, all nine. And um, I'll be letting you guys down too much. Um, Yeah, so that's crazy, man. So... That's all I got to say, pretty much. But, yeah, man, I mean, the bag love you. That's all I got to say, bro. Fuck these females. They toxic. I'm not going to say all females are toxic or whatever. I'm just saying just from experience. Because, like, you really, if you really like a girl, and then she, I mean, I understand that it takes a minute. It takes a minute. It takes a minute to, like, learn that process to like somebody. I, of course, I know that, but. I just want to get straight to the point. It's like now I'm like, I'm straightforward. I want to be straight to the point. Like if I were that, I just want to just be in a relationship with you and we build together. That's all I'm focused on, bro. But I ain't going to talk enough about that. I'll do that for another video. I know this is like a job of me. I ain't trying to get off topic or whatever. So if you want to see more videos like these, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And what I said? Subscribe. <laughs> I'm a fool, man. I'm trying to tell you. I'm like this off camera. But, um, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Peace.